True happiness is found in living in the present moment, but occasionally, if you pause and look around, we'll realize just how much things have changed. Let's take a closer look at the journey of our favorite Kung Fu stars and how they have gracefully aged over time. 1. Jackie Chan Jackie was born in Hong Kong on April 7, 1954. Jackie Chan, whose given name is Chan Kong Sang, is a Hong Kong actor, action choreographer, director of photography, comedian, producer, martial artist, screenwriter, businessman, singer, and stunt performer. He was also born in Hong Kong. He is well known for his acrobatic fighting technique, humorous timing, use of improvised weaponry, and imaginative stunts that he displays in the films that he has starred in. Since the 1970s, Jackie Chan has been working as an actor and he has starred in more than 100 films. Both the Hong Kong Avenue of Stars and the Hollywood Walk of Fame have honored Chan by placing stars in their respective locations. As a result of Chan's status as a cultural icon, he has been the subject of reference in a number of popular songs, cartoons, and video games. Chan is also a popular singer in the canto pop and mando pop music genres. He has published a number of albums and contributed his voice to the soundtracks of many of the movies in which he has featured. 2. Stephen Chow An actor, comedian, and director who was born in Hong Kong on June 22, 1962. He is known for his work in a number of different mediums. Chow has become a household figure in the world of action comedy films thanks to his distinctive combination of slapstick comedy and martial arts. He is known for this blend. A devoted following has been amassed for him as a result of his creative use of comedy as well as his physique and agility. Chow's performances, whether he is starring in films like As Shaolin Soccer or Kung Fu Hustle, are distinguished by his humorous timing, exaggerated mannerisms, and unexpected prowess in martial arts. 3. Biao Yuan He is a well-known actor, stunt performer, and martial artist who was born in Hong Kong on July 26, 1957. He also has a background in martial arts. Yuan has left an everlasting impression on Hong Kong cinema thanks to his acrobatic fighting style and perfect comedic timing. He is recognized for both of these qualities. Yuan's adaptability and agility have been highlighted in a number of films due to the fact that he was a member of the legendary Seven Little Fortunes gang, which also included Jackie Chan and Sam Ho Hung. Yuan's performances in Dreadnought and Once Upon a Time in China, as well as his involvement in the Lucky Star series, is notable for the agility, precision, and charming screen presence that he brings to action scenes. 4. Jet Li Jet Li is widely regarded as the preeminent practitioner of many forms of martial arts, both on and off the screen, since his birth on April 26, 1963 in Beijing, China. Because of his incredibly lightning-fast maneuvers and outstanding skills, he stands out from his contemporaries. In addition to his work as an actor, Jet Li is also known for his accomplishments in the world of martial arts and philanthropy. Because of his hypnotic performances in films like Fist of Legend and Hero, as well as his great dedication to promoting Wushu, Jet Li has become a symbol of discipline and endurance in the world of martial arts. 5. Sammo Hung He is an icon in the field of martial arts movies. Sammo Hung was born in Hong Kong on January 7, 1952, and he is known for his work in a number of films. Hung is not only a well-known actor, but he is also a director of films, a producer, and a choreographer. He is renowned for his dexterity, variety, and remarkable fighting skills. He had a career that spanned several decades, and during that time he imprinted an unmistakable stamp on the industry. Hung's on-screen presence is distinguished by his one-of-a-kind combination of athleticism and humorous timing, which has contributed to his status as a well-liked and revered figure in kung fu movies. 6. Bolo Young a Chinese martial artist and actor who was born on July 3, 1946 in Wangzhou. He is most well known for his imposing figure and the memorable parts he has played in which he portrays villains. Young has become a recognizable figure in the world of martial arts cinema thanks to his powerful physique and compelling on-screen presence. His portrayal of threatening villains in movies like Enter the Dragon and Bloodsport highlighted his formidable physique and terrifying presence on screen. Young's on-screen performances are distinguished by the viciousness, potency, and air of impending peril that he infuses into his characters. 7. Chia Hu Lu Who was born on August 22, 1955 in Wangdong, China, also known as Gordon Liu, is a martial artist and actor who has made important contributions to the field of kung fu movies. Chia Hu Lu is also known as Gordon Liu. He became famous for his portrayal of the legendary Shaolin monk San Te in the groundbreaking film The 36th Chamber of Shaolin. The performances of Liu are recognizable by the disciplined motions, 
technical accuracy, and austere presence that he brings to each piece. His expertise in a variety of kinds of martial arts, and especially in the field of Shaolin Kung Fu, has cemented his position as a recognized figure within the field of martial arts. 8. Wang Jang Lee Wang Jang Lee is a South Korean martial artist and actor. He was born on December 21, 1944 in Osaka, Japan, and is of Japanese ancestry. Lee has become linked with portraying strong antagonists because to his imposing physique, amazing kicking abilities, and terrifying screen presence. He is also known as the King of Kicks. His work with world-famous martial arts superstar Jackie Chan in movies such as Drunken Master and Snake in the Eagle's Shadow has brought to light the great talent he possesses and established him as a recognizable figure in the martial arts film industry. 9. Michelle Yeoh Michelle Yeoh, who was born on August 6, 1962 in Ipoh, Malaysia, is regarded as a pioneer for women working in the film industry of martial arts. Yeoh has managed to win the hearts of people all across the world because of her gracefulness, beauty, and dogged drive. She is well known for performing her own stunts, and throughout her action sequences, she has demonstrated a tremendous level of expertise as well as bravery. From her breakthrough part in Police Story 3 Supercop, to her international success in films like Crouching Tiger, Hidden Dragon, Yo's performances are distinguished by her elegance, intensity, and dedication to her craft. Her career began with her breakout role in Police Story 3 Supercop. 10. Donnie Yen Born in Wangzhou, China on July 27, 1963, is a major force in the kung fu film industry. With a broad skill set and a steadfast dedication to his trade, Yen has attained international acclaim and gained a particular place in the hearts of martial arts devotees. Yen was raised in Boston, Massachusetts, and got a start in martial arts at a young age. His mother, Bo Sim Mark, who is also a well-known martial artist, had a big influence on how passionate he became about art. She helped Yen hone his abilities and get a thorough understanding of many martial arts techniques. Beyond his proficiency in traditional Chinese forms like Wing Chun and Tai Chi, Yen's martial arts aptitude goes beyond that. He has also studied Taekwondo, Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu, and Western boxing, among other styles, demonstrating his adaptability and versatility as a fighter. Donnie Yen's portrayal of Ip Man, the renowned Wing Chun Grandmaster and Bruce Lee's teacher, marked his breakthrough as an actor. The movie Ip Man and its follow-ups not only displayed Yen's extraordinary martial arts skill, but also his dramatic versatility and emotional range. One of the most accomplished martial arts performers of his time, he cemented his reputation with his nuanced depiction of the famous character. Yen exudes a distinct combination of grace, force, and precision on film. His fight scenes are expertly orchestrated, flawlessly fusing age-old methods with cutting-edge maneuvers. Audiences are in awe of Yen's extraordinary skills in all of his performances. Whether he is engaging in hand-to-hand -hand combat or deftly using weaponry, Donnie Yen has contributed significantly as an action director and choreographer in addition to his work as an actor, helping to define the visual style of martial arts movies. His attention to detail and talent for writing exciting fight scenes have taken the genre to new heights. 11. Ji Han Jae Is known as a pioneer of Korean martial arts and an important player in the growth of Hapkido. He was born on August 5, 1936 in Andong, South Korea and is considered to be one of the founders of Hapkido. Ji Han Jai's contribution to the world of martial arts go far beyond the roles he has played in films and television shows because he is the creator of Sinmu Hapkido. However, his filmography includes important roles in which he displayed his expertise. One example of this is his performance as the antagonist Thunderleg in Bruce Lee's Game of Death. The performances of Ji Han Jai are distinguished by the dynamic methods agility, and deep-rooted understanding of Hapkido that he brings to the stage. 12. Vincent Zhao He was born in Harbin, China on April 10, 1972, and is a highly gifted actor and martial artist. It was his performance as wushu expert Wang Fei Hung in the film series Once Upon a Time in China that brought him to public attention and propelled him to popularity. His performances are distinguished by the fluidity of his motions and precision of his work, and the charming screen presence he exudes. Zhao's performances always emanate a feeling of integrity and nobility, which helps to reinforce his position as a revered character in the world of martial arts film. This is true whether he is portraying a real-life figure or a hero from a work of fiction. 13. Robert Wall A well-known name in the world of kung fu cinema, he was born in Los Angeles, California on August 22, 1939, and is a well-known American martial artist and actor. 
Wall's skills have been highlighted in films such as Enter the Dragon and Game of Death, where he worked alongside Bruce Lee, a legend in the world of martial arts. Wall has been trained in a variety of martial arts disciplines, including Kenpo Karate and Taekwondo. Wall's performances are distinguished by the dynamic nature of his fighting technique, the high-flying kicks he does, and the dexterity with which he executes sophisticated choreography. The work that he did along with Bruce Lee helped to solidify his position as a significant player in the genre. 14. Tony Jaa Tony Jaa, who was born in Thailand on February 5, 1976, is a martial artist and actor who has garnered international renown for his jaw-dropping action sequences and intense dedication to his craft. Jha was born on February 5, 1976. The results of Jha's time spent training in Muay Thai are readily apparent in his work in the film industry. His breakthrough film, Ongbak, Muay Thai Warrior, displayed his extraordinary athleticism, bone-crushing strikes, and incredible stunt work. The film was a box office success. Because of his unwavering dedication to doing his own stunts and carrying out sophisticated combat choreography with pinpoint accuracy, Jha has created a legion of devoted followers. His succeeding films, such as The Protector and Tom Yum Goong, helped to further solidify his position as one of the most electrifying martial arts stars of the modern period. 15. David Chang A multi-talented actor as well as a skilled martial artist who has made important contributions to the field of Hong Kong cinema. David Chang was born on June 29, 1947 in Shanghai, China. Chang, who is renowned for his smooth demeanor and charismatic film presence, has played a diverse assortment of roles during the course of his career. His performances are distinguished by the emotional depth he brings to his roles, along with his exquisite timing and impressive martial arts skills. His characters range from heroic martial arts figures to nuanced anti-heroes. The Shaw Brothers films, in which Chang has worked alongside director Chang Che, have helped solidify Chang's position as a well-respected personality within the genre. 16. Angela Mao a pioneering figure in the industry of martial arts films. Angela Mao was born on September 20, 1950 in Taiwan, and she is known for her work in the industry. Mao, often known as the Lady Whirlwind, was one of the first female martial arts stars to earn popularity on a global scale. Mao displayed a commanding presence on screen thanks to the remarkable talents she possessed in a variety of martial arts techniques, including Hapkido and Wushu. Her performances in movies like Hapkido and Enter the Dragon showcased her dexterity, swiftness, and unyielding willpower. Mao's contributions to the genre established her as a pioneer in the martial arts film industry and opened the path for other female martial arts stars to emerge in the years to come. That's all for the video today. We will be right back. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel. Thanks for watching, and we will see you in the next one.